hey guys welcome to my channel on today's video we are going to be talking about the disease gonorrhea before we proceed those who are visiting the channel for your first time please do hit the subscribe button and turn on your notification so whenever we upload a video you'll be the first to know about it so we have the following objectives what is gonorrhea how is gonorrhea spread symptoms of gonorrhea Effects of untreated gonorrhea, methods by which gonorrhea can be diagnosed, and how can gonorrhea be prevented? So what is gonorrhea? Gonorrhea is a sexually transmitted infection caused by the bacteria called Neisseria gonorrhea. It can cause infection in the genitals, rectum, eyes, and throat. Gonorrhea can be transmitted or spread by one of the following methods. It can be transmitted from mother to baby during pregnancy, labor, or nursing. It can also be transmitted by having unprotected vaginal, anal, or oral sex. Let's take a look at the various symptoms caused by gonorrhea. In women, you might have symptoms such as increased vaginal discharge, low abdominal pain, vaginal bleeding between periods, painful or burning sensation when urinating. In men, we may have symptoms such as a burning sensation when urinating, a white, yellow, or green discharge from the penis, painful or swollen testicles. The symptoms caused by rectal infection include anal itching, anal discharge, soreness, bleeding, and painful bowel movement. Let's take a look at the effects of untreated gonorrhea. Firstly, we look at complications in babies. Babies who contract gonorrhea from their mothers during birth can develop blindness, sores on the scalp, and infections. Secondly, we look at infertility in women. Gonorrhea can spread to the uterus and the fallopian tubes, causing pelvic inflammation disease, which can result in scarring of the tube, greater risks of pregnancy complications, and infertility. Infertility in men Gonorrhea can cause inflammation of the epididymis, resulting in epididymitis, which if left untreated can lead to infertility. We might also have effects such as miscarriages and atopic pregnancy. Now let's take a look at the methods by which gonorrhea can be diagnosed. It can be diagnosed by color urine test, culture of throat, urethra and anus swab, can also be diagnosed by carotid gram staining as well as the endocervical or vaginal specimen using nucleic acid amplification testing. How can gonorrhea be prevented? The most efficient way of preventing STDs is by abstinence. It can also be prevented by a monogamous relationship with a partner who has been tested and is known to be uninfected. It can also be prevented by the use of condom. Thank you for watching and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on your notification so whenever I upload a new video, you'll be the first to know about it.